the ones on my list are actually about to blow up, believe me, the next Emma Chamberlain is amongst those girls. The best thing about my existence is the fact that I am owning this sweater. <laughs> Trying to roll into the frame as an intro. Hey mom and random people on the internet watching this right now, it's Cece and I'm laying in my bed for no particular reason. You know, this is actually just like such a sit back and relax video, so I was like, I'm gonna relax while filming it, I'm just <laughs> so lazy. <laughs> this is just a quick little video that I wanted to film for ages and then just a while back some lovely girl on the channel Shack Attack actually filmed a similar video. She was basically talking about all the small YouTubers you definitely need to check out on this platform and also mentioned my channel in this video which was so lovely. Thank you. No, but there are actually so many amazing small creators out there and I personally watch quite a few of them so I was like maybe I should talk about my favorites and you could also check them out. It's all about like supporting each other especially like in the small YouTuber community and I think it's so important and I personally really enjoy doing it and I really enjoy like venturing out and finding new people. It's always a fun time and you should definitely try to do the same with the channels that I'm about to mention. First channel actually is that Shack Attack and I'm not only saying this because she gave me a shout out in her video. I actually enjoy her personality and her videos so much. If you are into kind of like weekly vlog stuff and also just like talkative videos, basically like similar videos to mine, which you should be into because otherwise why are you watching my channel? No, but if you enjoy those kind of videos and also like I think she does like booktube stuff which is also like really interesting and I definitely need to get more into that because I love reading low-key. No, but I'm sure that everyone will find something interesting on her channel. So definitely click the link down below. The next person I wanted to mention in this video is Madison Page. Now she's not only a great supporter of other small YouTubers as well, but she also has a channel herself and it's actually blimmin' amazing. Something I particularly enjoy on her channel are the videos where she tries to kind of get famous on a particular platform, like for example Tumblr, Facebook, Twitter. She's done quite a few of those they are actually so interesting so you should definitely give those a watch next up on my top list is my absolute fave maria i actually met maria through a group chat on twitter and i'm so lucky that i did because her content is just so amazing i would describe it as comedy with a weird sense of humor that i personally get very well and if you watch my videos you probably also kind of get my humor and therefore also definitely will get hers i don't even know how to describe her content I just think you should check out one of her little videos and you definitely won't regret it. Another lovely human being that I actually also met on Twitter is Rebecca Elizabeth. Now she actually started around the same time that I did on YouTube and she just gained subscribers on and on and on and on and there's a reason for that. Rebecca is just like so different in my opinion. She's really honest, she's raw, she's funny, she's entertaining and she has just like a great personality in front of the camera and I think that really comes across to the viewers. She also basically is just like a fan account for all the big YouTubers. Like, you will definitely relate to Rebecca and therefore you should probably give her a watch. Now, next on my list is Luna. Fun fact, similar to me, Luna's first language actually isn't English, but she does videos in English and they are very interesting. Luna just basically likes to share her opinion on all kinds of topics like school or also like pop culture and also like the KSI and Logan fight she did a little video on. It's always so interesting to hear her opinion on stuff. So if you're interested to see another take on different current topics and also kind of little challenges in between, she's definitely the right channel to go to. Another favorite of mine is Claw. Claw once again actually isn't from the United Kingdom or the United States. She actually is from Spain and she studies there and she does all kinds of like little vlogs and like story time and she's also interested into fashion and beauty and all the girly stuff. She's just like one of those very positive people that you immediately click with and you immediately get along with and you immediately relate to. So definitely give this girl a watch. Also if you like claw stuff you will definitely also enjoy Thea stuff. Thea is from Croatia, she does videos in English and she talks about music, her life, maybe also like fashion and beauty, just what she's interested in at the moment. But she does it in such a humble and nice and positive way that it's always worth a watch. I also wanted to recommend Laura's channel to you guys because Laura once again is different and Laura is sassy. Like if you enjoy like a mixture of story times and makeup stuff I would say definitely check out Laura because she's sassy and she knows how to talk and her accent is cute AF and you will definitely not regret it. A little channel that I also definitely wanted to mention in this video 
is the giraffe's life. I'm talking about Hannah. She actually also has a blog that I think has the exact same name and she's just a lovely person to watch. She does like vloggy bits and I think like she can handle the camera very well. Like if you're interested in seeing a bit of cinematic like combined with nice and interesting and chatty vlogs, Hannah's channel is the one to hit up. Wow, the lightning is changing. One sec guys. Are we better? Yeah, we better. Last but by no means least is my favorite little creator on this platform. It's Sam or Samantha and her channel is called Torposaurus and she is just hilarious let me tell you guys. I think she was like probably the first person that I kind of met over Twitter and that I kind of got in touch with and she also started YouTube around the same time that I did and she does like vlog stuff Like basically she just sits in her car and talks. You wouldn't think that's entertaining but it is so entertaining when she does it trust me. And I could like listen to her rambling about whatever for ages guys like i didn't know that a car wash could be so much fun to watch but it actually was you know so if you aren't subscribed to her channel what on earth are you doing also if you guys aren't subscribed to my channel what are you doing this is the outro and you should subscribe down below click the bell down below and i would actually really appreciate it actually if you enjoyed this video and want me to talk about more small creators as i said before i watch plenty of them definitely give this video a thumbs up also comment down below what small creator you enjoy watching because i would love to check them out and I'm sure other people will as well. Anyway, I just quickly wanted to plug my other social medias. As you do, you should follow them and kind of get in touch with me. I would love to get to know you guys. And yeah, I'm gonna have to do a weird outro like last time when I was laying in bed. Wow. Anyway, let's try it. Thank you for wasting your time with me today. <laughs> okay, bye. Back to school bloggers that actually aren't going back into school after the season and they're just doing it for the video and trying to be relatable. Well, I'm one of them. All my little tips and tricks on how to study stress-free. If you don't get organized right in the beginning, you won't stay organized and you won't get organized during the school year. Like, you won't do that. That's not possible. <laughs>